for yeah, many people it's um, it's really really exhausting now at this stage. Most staff had never dealt with cholera, so the pressure that was on the system wasn't just that uh, Yemen was completely unprepared because this is a this is a disease that has come because of the war. Um, so we had a lot of very scared staff who weren't sure how to treat it. So initially we began with um, trainings. So it was going to our ICRC supported facilities, training the staff on how the cholera treatment unit should be set up. So it's quite a particular way to infect, uh, to prevent cross infection and also the actual treatment of it. Cholera itself as a disease is very easy to treat if you get for treatment in time. We peaked at about seven and a half thousand cases a day. So now at the moment we're averaging about 5,000. So the trend is declining, but unfortunately we are just coming into rainy season and they are very heavy rains. So there is a possibility that uh, we will see another spike in cases because you have another overflow of the sewage system and also like driving through the streets, you have these huge floods and you see children playing in these um, sewage infected waters.